Hey guys, Sock here from Socky Ticket. In today's video, I have an amazing little trick for you guys. So let's dive in and get started. Now, this applies to most Samsung smartphones. It is a newer trick, so it may not be available on some of the older smartphones. All you're gonna have to do is check and see. So let me launch my gallery and show you exactly what I'm talking about. So let me go inside. So basically, with this trick, I can take any regular photo and turn it into a piece of art. So I can turn this photo into this, as you can see, looks fantastic, all right? One more example, here's just a regular photo, and here's the version that has been improved, turned into a piece of art, and here's just another example, as you can see, all right? One more example, here's a photo of my car, that's just a regular car, all right? And then I can transform it into this one, as you can see. It is as if somebody sat down and drew the whole thing professionally. And on top of that, there are some other things you can do with this trick. Further tweak your photos. So let me show you how to get it done. So let me just pick up a regular photo of mine right over here. And then once you have the photo, you tap on edit, all right? And then you tap on the three dots on the top right. And then you go to style. Now, obviously, you have to have that style button to get this done. If your phone doesn't have it, you probably do not have this feature. But I've tested this uh, with Samsung Galaxy S20s, Note 10s, S10s. They seem to all have it, so you might have it as well. Okay, so here's the photo, and here we have all of these various styles. We have the color pencil, okay? We've got the, um, the comic, okay? We've got the watercolor, as you can see. The blue ink, uh, we've got the marker, as you can see. We've got the line art, okay? And then we have the... Uh, the one that I was using for this photo, and we have all these options. Now, one thing I'm gonna show you real quick, it's very important. First and foremost, you can uh, change the intensity of the filter. So you can go from light to heavy, okay, that's fine. But there's one more thing I want you guys to notice. Now, you do get a special option when you're dealing with actual people. So you actually get to see, when you tap on this, you'll see a little frame icon right over here. Now, when I go back here, okay, and I go to a object, let's just grab a motorcycle. I'm gonna tap on this one right over here. I'm gonna go into style, and I can tap on this. And again, that gives me a fantastic effect, but notice you don't get little frame. So the phone knows when you're focused on a human, it gives you an additional option that makes things even better. Let me show you what I'm talking about. So let's uh, grab this photo. I'm gonna tap on, uh, oops, tap on edit go into style, all right? And then let's just pick this option here. I like, I happen to like that one a lot. Now when I tap this one, I can pick to apply that effect only to the actual person, the whole photo or just the background. I can, I can scroll through all the options as you can see. So I can have this one. See, I have the effect, the background is actually real. I can tap it again. Now the background has the effect but I am real, and then I can tap it again to apply the whole thing. When you're done, you tap on OK, you tap on Save, and it gets saved uh, right next to your other photo. Okay, so this is absolutely fantastic. Again, let's try one more here. Uh, let me tap on Edit. Let me go to Style. Again, this is a human being, a person. Well, it's me, obviously, but uh, you pick the option that you want to do, all right? And then if you... If you have a person, you get that frame icon, and you can switch between applying the effect only to you or everything else around you, okay? Absolutely fantastic, as you can see. There we go, there we go. That's crazy. You can play with your photos and come up with some amazing photos that you can even use uh, as an avatar on your Twitter or Instagram or YouTube, all right? So that's it. Uh, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below and let me know. And let me say it one more time. I'm not sure if this is going to work on all Samsung phones, but I tested them on the Note series, Note 10, S10, S20. So let me know down below if it works for you or not. And hopefully in the future with an update, it will. All right. Have a fantastic day, guys. All right. So if you found this video useful, make sure to subscribe to Saki Tech by clicking that button and also click that bell icon on the side to make sure you get notified every time I upload a new video. 
And if you do use Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, you can follow me at Saki Tech Online to get the latest updates as well. All right, have a fantastic day.